Inquisitor. Finally. Started to think you weren't coming. Nobody said you had to hang out in the creepy cave while you waited. Well, I did wait, so let's make this quick. These idiots are carrying the Red Lyrium out in unprotected containers. We don't want to stick around long enough for to start talking to us. Why would the containers need to be protected? Lyrium is incredibly dangerous in its raw form. It can poison or kill dwarves, and we're resistant to it. Sometimes it just explodes. No warning. Basically, only crazy people mine lyrium. The mining cast doesn't just sling it into a bucket. It's carried in special containers that keep it under control. And that's normal lyrium. The red stuff is worse. I wouldn't be surprised if most of their miners die just digging it up. You seem to know more about the effects of red lyrium than most. Varric needed a save for his shard. I'm the one who built it for him. How did you find this operation in the first place? There must be hundreds of deep roads entrances. I've used this entrance in the past. Varric's not the only surface dwarf to explore the deep roads. Oh, I've got to admit, I was pretty surprised when I came here and found it full of humans. If you're coming with us, I hope you can handle a fight. No, I thought I'd cower helplessly while you do all the work. He's a decent shot. Decent? You want me to admit you're better than me? In front of the Inquisitor? Let's not waste any more time, shall we? What you do now? Beg pardon? Skulking around in caves, shooting guys. Is this your day to day? I usually try to avoid the caves.
You had me worried, you know. What did I do now? That letter you sent me about the Red Lyrium was the first I'd heard from you since the Chantry explosion. Had it been that long? Seriously, if you died in that mess, I'd have come back to Kirkwall and dug you up just to kick your ass. What would you do if I'd been cremated? Kick your ashes, of course. I built these doors. They probably shut this one from the other side when they heard the ruckus we were making. Ta-da! You've been here often enough to renovate the cave. You already know I've used this entrance in the past. I don't know if Eric's told you, but the Merchant's Guild is cutthroat. Literally. I built the doors to keep rivals from following me down here and arranging accidents. I guess it's a good thing you came along then. I get that a lot. After you. What's his name? Bogdan? He's in Navarra right now, selling my machine to wealthy landowners. I heard some of the guild were trying to get you named a paragon for that contraption. That's not gonna happen, even if I am ten times the Smith Bronca ever was. A surfacer paragon? Never. This is almost fun. Kind of like old times. I don't recall us ever shooting people together. Remember crashing Bartram's guild dinner? We might as well have shot him. This isn't nearly as dangerous as pissing off my brother. <laughs> <laughs> 